How are we going, everyone? Got my trusty kitchen scales out. And you know why I got them out? We're gonna go and weigh the big malaka. Now, earlier in the morning, I came out. Now, I haven't been in here for a couple of days. Some of you may know where I've been because I've turned up to your home with a couple of goodies, doing a bit of driving around, seeing what's going on out there. And it's a great opportunity for me to see some of the wonderful gardens around Victoria. I actually did get about 300, 400 kilometers outside of my property here, which was a lot of fun. I got home very late. But in saying that, the gardens out there are just astounding. I've seen some uh, far and wide from, uh, uh, where were we, Northcote, uh, Camberfield, Thomastown, Mill Park, out, out to Ashwood, Montrose, got down to uh, Rosebud. Uh, it went on and on and on. I can't remember all the places, but I really enjoyed the opportunity to see what people are growing and some of the gardens. now. I'm on 20 acres, yes, and why I say that is because some of the gardens, if not most of those gardens, were small or average sized blocks or even small courtyard style gardens. And everyone's giving it a go, no matter how big or small the space is, they really have some of, actually I did meet one lady uh, in Ivanhoe, I've forgotten your name, ma'am, uh, but you did blow me away with all your plant life there. You told me you love mama. And now she's probably my mother's equal uh, in pot plants. She just constantly propagates and collects and uses our wonderful products, the black root, liquid gold, eco butch, and obviously the superfood. Now today, um, these are the products here anyway. These are the plants themselves. That's the one where with the superfood and this one here, the mandevilla, both are, let me just quickly go over this before we do the weighing of the tomatoes. Have a look at this. It's crusted over on the surface, superfood only, crusted over, new growth. The old leaves have fallen off. That's where they are here. This is the purpose while we're doing is to see how they react. Now we're not, we haven't mixed this in with anything. It's pure superfood. Technically a, a compost or not even a compost. It's actually, and we're gonna go through the details about this. It's not a compost, it's a casting. It's a, it's a larvae casting, similar to what you get with your worms. And again, look, crusted over on top, but look how, I'll grab a bit underneath. Look at the moisture underneath there. Is it dripping? Not quite, but it is moist. You can see it there, right? Just above the surface. So it acts as a mulch, a covering, a blanket. It crusts over. You can see the shrinkage there. But just below the shrinkage, if I could quickly crack the surface open, it's super damp underneath there. So it, it, it holds its moisture. I can say that after a few goes in watering it, it actually holds its moisture. And this plan is pushing on new growth. The mandevilla is slower, obviously, for being a different plant. So, again, they are doing well. I'm so tempted to tip it out, should I? Wet as. Have a look. There's no roots yet. Wet as. So, that doesn't need to be watered. Look where the crust is. I'm losing a bit of soil. See the crusting over? Just the first five mil. That's the dryness. That's the blanket. So, it becomes a mulch blanket or an organic fertilizing mulch blanket. We lost a little bit there. But the rest of it is a growing medium as well. So there might be a potty mix in there somewhere, eh? What do you reckon? Leave that aside. Let's go and get some big malakas. Pretty much all of them have to be harvested, folks, because they've already been attacked. Some of them have been picked. You can see one down in there. It's got a big hole in it. Can you see that one down in there? It's a big chunks taken out of it. So they're all holding the same similar color. Not completely ripened the way I want them to be, fully ripened on the vine because that's the best way to get your flavors out of the plant or the fruit that is. So in this case, the tomato, super soft, super ripe, super sweet. But if we leave it on here too long, we may not even get a super tomato. So we're gonna harvest the big malaka here. And I better hurry up and harvest because from this morning, you banana. I didn't bring a secateur. From this morning, that is three hours. In the last three hours, something's come in and eaten the ass out of it. Sorry, the bottom half out of it. Snails and slugs again, look, they're out again, folks. So if you're gonna use any snail pellets, get our Eradicate Eco-Friendly Certified Organic Snail Bait. We're gonna weigh this one. Mm, one and a half, maybe, maybe. Let's compare it to this. You reckon we can save this one a little bit longer? No, that needs to ripen a bit more. One more, there's one more over here. Oh, okay. That's got a bit of density in it. Okay, I can't break it off. Silly me. There we are. Scales, set to zero. 
calibrated. These aren't the biggest ones I've ever grown, but half decent. One kilo, 91 grams. Not bad. I'm not up there with the big boys. One kilo, 136. Hey, I reckon I lost at least 50 grams here. So I'm going to say that's 1.2. Yeah. Huh? Otherwise I'll fill it up with water and do it again. Then you'll say, wow, that's two kilos. How did you get that facility? I don't do things like that. I'm a good boy. I don't lie. I tell you, yeah, actually, I reckon at least 50 grams have been eaten out of it. Look at it. It's chewed into there and in there. Nevertheless, that is our big malaka. We're going to let these ripen up a little bit more. Not going to leave them there. If you haven't grown one, folks, we've still got a few online. It's facilitiesgarden.com. Big malakas and the big Italian malakas are out as well. So both varieties are out. Limited supply. We don't have a lot of seeds of them. So we're probably, you know, I reckon another month's worth maximum of tomatoes left in growing. And out of that, we're only going to get a handful of seeds. So if you haven't got your seeds, get some now before they sell out. And if you're watching this just as it's been uploaded, folks, it's our big 3AW weekend gardening show with me, Darren James, uh, starting from 6.30 a.m. till 8 a.m. on Saturday and Sunday. So tune in with your gardening questions and ideas if you've got anything to share. Maybe you're growing a bigger one than this. Maybe you give us a call and tell us how much it weighs. And because it's a gardening weekend, it's a 3AW uh, weekend sale. So type in the coupon code 3 AW to get your discount up to 85% off a huge range of gardening products, including the big malakas, superfood, black grid, and all the rest. Vasilisgarden.com, tune into 3AW from Eva Silly, Maresi.